I enter this code and I get 100 Robux. Do you want Robux? I'm giving away 100 Robux every single video to those who subscribe, like the video, turn on post notifications, comment that you subscribe to the channel with your Roblox username, and I'll pick somebody from this video to give Robux to. Hello everybody, it's Grayfin here, and guys, today I'm gonna be showing you how to get free items in Roblox. Items received from promo codes. These are really working promo codes for Roblox. If you ignore it, you get no Robux. But remember, if you like, subscribe, and turn on post notifications, you can get 100 Robux. This person's gonna be extremely happy if they get 100 Robux, but that's only if they're in the Roblox group. So their username is real R. But that sounds really sketchy to be honest with you. Uh, but let's see if they're in the group. And oh, they are in the Roblox group. Alrighty, they are not a bot, they are a real person. We're gonna pay you out 100 Robux in three, two, one, and distribute. And boom, 100 Robux have been paid out to real art bot. If it wasn't already obvious enough, make sure you're in the Roblox group. So many people that watch my videos and they're subscribed to my channel are not my Roblox group. And it's like, what? How am I supposed to give you Robux if you're not in my group? That is like the number one thing you have to do so I can give you Robux. It's called the Grey Finney's fan group. It's the first link down below in the description i also leave it in the pinned comment we are so close to 300,000 members if we end up hitting 300,000 members really soon then i'll probably do like a 300,000 robux giveaway or something i have to figure it out but that's an insane milestone i'm gonna be surprising people that watch the entire video so make sure you stick around to the end in one of my previous videos i showed off a leak of all the week three roblox lubu accessories well they're finally here they're not out yet but they're uploaded on Roblox, so we're going to be able to get them for free really soon. And when I mean really soon, I mean this coming Tuesday. First, we have the Lubu Wealthy Glasses, and the description is, these glasses will make you look like the most wealthy person on Lubu. Oh my gosh, I mean these ones are pretty cool and really crazy rich looking. I mean these are Chinese coins, so if you got glasses made out of coins, you are flexing your wealth on Roblox. These are going to be the go-to glasses that you're going to want to want on Roblox. I'm not sure how you're going to style these, but they're pretty cool looking. And honestly, I mean I have my rainbow glasses on right now, but we could maybe change them out. Maybe we wear these Lubu Wealthy glasses instead of those rainbow glasses that we have on right now. I don't know. What do you guys think? Should I change them out or keep my glasses that I have right now? I'm on the fence about it. Next, we have the traditional Chinese hat. And the description is, this hat needs to be matched with clothing with similar styles. Otherwise, it will look dull. Hmm. What is Roblox trying to tell us? So they're saying that in order for this hat to stand out, we need to style it with clothes of similar look. So does this mean that this hat isn't as good as the others? I don't know. I mean, this hat already looks pretty cool. It's got some hair coming down the back as well. I think this hat already stands out as it is. I don't know what Roblox is really saying here. The next accessory is the upside down china bowl and the description is when you find that there are not enough bowls in your meal this hat comes in handy wait what if you're wanting cereal and you're out of bowls like they're all dirty does that mean like if you just have one on your head because you just carry it around for just in case does that mean this is that what roblox is trying to say that we should put bowls on our head in case we need a bowl sometime <laughs> That seems pretty crazy if you ask me. Roblox, what are you talking about? I mean, I like it. It's very silly. It's kind of corny. I like it. I really do. It's really funny. It'd make for a really funny Roblox outfit. And I mean, it looks really weird on my character. It looks like I'm wearing like a bandana and oh my gosh, it looks so weird. The next item we have is the bun hair with flower hairpin. And the description is, butterflies often come to me. Of course, there are also bees. Oh, I get it because it's a flower hairpin and you're putting a flower in your hair. So of course you will get butterflies and bees. This is really cool. I really like this hat. Not that I'm gonna wear it, but mainly because it'll give girls on Roblox the opportunity to have more options when it comes to hair, especially free hair, because a lot of the free hairs on Roblox aren't the nicest looking, they're kind of blocky, but this one actually looks like a paid hair. So you could be able to style some really nice outfits with this. So I think it's gonna make a lot of the girls really happy. And the last item is the Le Lantern. Now, I don't know if I'm pronouncing that wrong, or right, I'm probably saying it wrong because I don't know how to say that word, but the description is put on this lantern and you won't get lost at night. All right, yes, I agree with that. This should be very bright. Let's see what it looks like. Is this a shoulder accessory or back accessory? Okay, I don't see it on my character. I'm gonna assume that this is probably a back accessory. Yep, it is. Wait a second, but if it's bright and it's on our back, how are we gonna be able to see at night? Because it's on our back. It would be like a ton of light behind this. I mean, I guess, if you at your feet, but it's like, wait, what? Because you can't see where you're going because all the lights on your back. 
I don't know. I like it, but I'm not sure how it really works on Roblox. But the only problem I see with this is that if you're trying to style something with this, it's on your back. It's really small as you guys saw, so I'm not sure how you're going to be able to style anything with it. The only time people are going to see it is if they're behind you. Now, like most accessories each week, there is some controversy. This one's called the Fine China Ramen Bowl, and this one's 15 Robux. But look, this one's blue, and if you look at the design on it, it's almost identical, if not identical, to the red one. I think the only difference is that it's red. I don't think they changed up the design at all. It's literally like the exact same bowl. So all the people that bought this for 15 Robux, I'm, I'm assuming there's 20,000 people that bought it for 15 Robux. Well, if they had waited just a little bit longer, they could have got it for free. But to me, it doesn't matter because that's just 15 Robux. Plus, it gives people who don't have the money to buy Robux the opportunity to enjoy Robux by getting really cool hats on Roblox and styling their avatar with them. But what are your thoughts on these new Roblox accessories that are coming out next week, which is like in just a few days? And what are your thoughts on Roblox retexturing the fine China ramen bowl into the upside down China bowl? So you've made it to the end of the video and you wanna know what the surprise is. Well, I'm gonna be surprising people with some Robux. All you have to do is leave a comment down below with your Roblox username telling me how you're gonna style these new Roblox hats. Like, what are you gonna wear? What color is your outfit gonna be? You're gonna wear this with that? Give me the rundown on your Roblox avatar. And I'll be picking people from the comments down below who leave really cool outfits and rewarding them with 50 Robux. But remember, if you like, subscribe, and turn on post notifications, you can get 100 Robux.